welcome. Thanks for joining us. Double A Baseball on the show coming your way. It's the Montgomery Biscuits taking on the Frisco Rough Riders. And now, and we'll be back with the first Frisco pitch right after this. Rough Rider. So just about set now. Xavier Edwards gets a chance to hit here. The 1-1. One, one. There's a strike. Swing and a miss. Struck him out. One out. And now Greg Jones. A switch hitter batting right. And a count one and two. One down, base is empty. Right side. And that's a base hit. So they get a man aboard with a one out single. Cameron Meisner, the next to hit. Double play ball to second. Foscue. Tosses to first, two away. Here's the third baseman, Curtis Mead. The third baseman, Curtis Mead. Runner leads away at second. Now fly ball to right center. Makes a nice grab at a full sprint, and that's the inning. Bottom of the first, stepping in, Jonathan Ornelas. And he deals. Just missed. Fouls one off, two and two. Foul ball. Stays alive. The wind and the pitch. 3 2 now. The wind to kick the pitch. Fouled off again. And it remains three and two. And he walked him. Well, that's a nice job of grinding out that at bat. Saw a lot of pitches and ends up drawing the walk. Very gritty. Here's the second baseman, Justin Foscue. Next offering misses, two and one. Runner. Runner takes off. Swing and a miss. Throw to second, tag, and they got him. The pitch. And that one off the outside edge. Really good take, especially with two strikes. And the right hander deals. And there's a foul ball. 3-2 now. Slowly on the ground to short. Jones handles. Over to first. Two away. Two outs. Base is empty. Here's Josh Young. The third baseman. Next offering is in for a strike. Righty delivers. And another ball. Inside, just missed. Curveball kind of backed up on him there. I think it just slid out of the hand a little bit too soon. Line drive, caught. Back 
here at the ballpark. Top of the second. And now the first baseman, number four. The lefty ready and a 1-1. One -one. They say you win. Lace down the line, and now maybe extra bases. And that one's going to get into the corner. And that's a leadoff double. Good two-strike hitting right there, Boog. A bit of a lost start for some, so that was nicely done to beat the odds. Pretty much a model swing on that one as he ripped it into the opposite field gap, and I'm sure he's going to be watching that one back on video because that's the kind of swing you want to bottle. So many positives that led to that knock. Thompson makes the grab, and there's one down. Nick Schnell now at the plate. Number four, the runner at second with one away. Swing and a miss. And the count, one and two. And that's downstairs and outside. 2-2 two -two now. And that's outside. And now the lefty. And a foul ball. He stays alive. And a payoff pitch. And that one fouled off. Payoff pitch. Got him. And there's two away. Now the catcher up to hit. Blake Hunt. Two outs. That one off the mark. And that's ball three. Slow roller up the middle. Foskey gloves it. And that'll do it. Of the second. Now it's the right fielder, Carl Chester. The wind of the pitch. That's a strike. He needs a quick one, two, three this time around. Last inning through a lot of pitches. Next pitch misses inside. Ball two. That one hammered left field. That's back there. And gone! He'll touch them all. And they jump ahead in the second. It's 1-0. Steel Walker digs in now. The 1-1 is cut on and missed to the pitch upstairs. Kicks and deals. On the ground right side. Edwards collects. That's one out the bottom of the second. Here's Bubba Thompson. The 2-1. And a foul ball. The wind of the pitch. Stays alive. Two two now. And a swing and a miss. Down on strikes. Two down. Davis Wenzel getting ready to hit. And a pitch. Left field way back there. That's back. And out of here. So he just clears the wall, and they add to their lead. It's 2-0. Two, two outs, nobody on. And stepping in is the speedy Dustin Harris. The next pitch misses, and that's ball two. And that one just missed off the outside edge. Left-hand batter waits. And there's a strike. The pitch. 
Good plate appearance there. Able to take the walk. Boom, do you think you could draw a walk in the bigs if we gave you enough at-bats? Oh, that's a good question. Um, I think that if they gave the pitcher a full scouting report on me, yes, I think I could draw a walk. Harris leads off first with two down to the inning. And here is David Garcia. Next one misses and a count two and one. The pitch. That one fouled off two and two. Swing and a miss. And he's down on strikes. Good job at damage control right there. Welcome back. And yeah, the batter now, Nico Holsizer. Well, after putting up a nice inning on offense, got some runs across, this is where you look for the starter to go out there, have a shutdown inning. Don't give that other team any hope. Uh, you just hope that he can get through this inning, get the bats back up there while they're hot. Swing and a miss. Two and two. Two and two. Out towards right center field, and that'll fall for a base hit. Man aboard on the leadoff single. Xavier Edwards will hit next. Double play ball to second, and that chance handled. Off balance speed, there's one. Over to first, safe. Good fade and sinking action of that changeup. Got that hitter to roll over. Next pitch is downstairs. This is one of those situations the infielders have to pre-plan and understand that the ball's got to be hit extremely hard right at them if they're going to have a chance to go for a double play. Next offering is downstairs. So here we go. Base runner at first could be running on the pitch. He's got good enough speed to steal the bag to get in scoring position, even if it's a swing and miss at the plate. Well, interesting, he went with the off-speed and walked the hitter. Man, you got to challenge the guy with the fastball. One out, runners at first and second. Next pitch misses, and that's ball three. Fought off foul. Some real good life going through the zone on that one. And that'll load the bases. Oh, that sets up a really big at bat in this game. These are the moments when everyone in the stadium gets really locked in. So bases loaded with one away. And next will be the cleanup hitter, Curtis Mead. Hit it well, but flied out to the deepest part of the outfield his first time. That one the other way. Base hit. One run is in. Relay throw. And he's in there as they score a pair on the play. Well, that was an important at-bat in this game, so a great job there stepping up to the challenge. Anytime you rip a line drive the other way, you feel really good about what you did at the plate. You trusted your hands, you let the ball travel, and you took the barrel straight to it. That's great work right there. And there's ball four. Number 64. Tied up here in the early going. I think ultimately you want to tie him up, get the ball in on the plate so that he can't get the barrel to it and hit it to the outfield. Swing and a ball popped up. Ornelas makes the catch. And there's two away. Yeah, that was a wasted RBI opportunity, but a competitor like him, he is looking forward to making up for it in his next at bat. Here comes a pitch. He swings and fouls one off. Number 31 at third, number 44 at second, number four at first, two out of the inning. Out to short, base hit, one run is in. Walker fires it to the plate, in there, he scores. And they take a two-run lead.
Well, he had the opportunity to drive in some runs, and he comes through to break the tie. I really like that swing, man. He didn't just push it the other way through the infield. He drove it that way, and it kind of makes me think he was thinking opposite field as he stepped into the box, got a pitch he liked, and he got it done. And here it comes. Swings and misses. It's two and two. Two on, two outs. And a swing and a miss. And that is that. And welcome back. Set for the bottom of the third. And now the shortstop, Jonathan Ornelas. Here's a one-two. And that one missing low. Two-two. Swung on, belted. That one back there. Pulls it in on the warning track. Man, he hammered that one to center. I thought it was out of here, but Wynn just absolutely killed it. So digging in, Justin Foscue. The 1-1. This one popped up. Edwards should have this one. Pulls it down, and he makes the catch. And there's two down. Well, that's a frustrating into the at-bat for the hitter right there. I mean, that pitch was right down the middle. I think he got a little too excited, came out of his mechanics, and instead of driving that ball somewhere, he popped it up. Unfortunate for him. Two down, nobody on. Lined into right. Lays out, but it's off his glove. Base hit, and the inning continues. Well, patience and discipline paid off right there as he got into an advantage count. I'll tell you, man, it's such a good feeling when you smoke a line drive into the gap like that. I mean, sure, home runs are king, but I feel like nothing makes you feel... This one's into the outfield. Could be extra bases. Young, around third. Jones with a relay home. Tag safe at home. And they trail by one couple of hits in a row for him here textbook bat control right there got a pitch on the outside saw it deep into the zone and just barreled it up went the other way for the knock next to hit steel walker chester at second with two down swing and a pop off in foul ground me makes the catch and that'll do it here at the ballpark out of the fourth digging in Nico Holsizer the pitch and one and two well he hasn't quite settled in out there four runs in three innings he's gonna have to have some quick one two three innings to pitch deep into this ball game that hits the dirt it's two and two just not taking the bait right there, but a good pitch with two strikes. And down on strikes, and one gone. So the batting order turns over. Xavier Edwards, the next to hit. The one-two. Bounced up the middle. Foscu handles the chance in there safely. Man at first with one gone. Greg Jones digs in now. Hit on the ground might be two. Fires to second for one. Back to first. Not in time. So up next, Cameron Meisner. the 2-1 good eye in that spot Chris with that distraction and a speedy guy at first he's in a favorable hitters count well if nothing else I mean this is a great spot for a hitter to be in in the air to left center and that one hops the wall
Well, they call that an advantage count for a reason. You're so much more likely to get something you can handle. I love the approach he had right there with that pitch. Not trying to do too much, but still looking to drive it, and that's exactly what he's able to do into the opposite field gap for the double. Out to center. Thompson has a beat on it. And he makes the catch. And that'll do it. Bottom four. Digging in, it's the speedy outfielder, Bubba Thompson. It's good speed at the top of the order here. You want to get it on, see if you can get a stolen base, maybe get around the bases and pick up a run. And the righty deals. And down on strikes he goes. One out in the bottom of the fourth. And next is the designated hitter, Davis Wenzel. And the pitch. And that one clips the corner. Righty to the plate. Hit weakly on the ground. Jones picks it up. Already two gone here in the home fourth. This is important. If he can go one, two, three here, will be a very positive sign for him and for his team. And a 1-1. That clips a corner. Left-hand hitter waits. And now the count is even. That's where you want it. It's a good miss. Now all even up. On the ground at first, and that's just foul. Kicks and fires. This one lifted in the air, left field. Holsizer makes the catch, and that'll do it. We're back, and there's a new arm on the mound to start the fifth. Ricky Venasco. And his job is to collect quick outs and keep his team within striking distance. Well, at this point of the ball game, we're talking about middle innings, and you need a little length out of this arm coming out of the bullpen. We'll see just how many outs he's able to give his skipper. We go to the top of the fifth, and here's the first baseman, number four. Right-hander kicks deals. And that one pulled foul. Right-handed reliever. Swag and a miss. The velocity blasted it right past him. So now here's the DH. Number 64. Hit pretty well in the air out to center. Thompson under it. He makes the catch. And there's two down. Here's the center fielder, Nick Schnell. Swings and misses, and he's down on strikes for the second time today. We head to the bottom of the fifth. And now the switch hitting catcher, David Garcia. Swing and a miss. And the count is one and two. Just missed. And the pitch. On the ground, out to short. Sends it across He's the out. first, and that's the first out in the bottom of the fifth. The Jonathan Ornelas now at the plate. 1-1 one, one now. Now this one is smoked down the left field line. On its way, if it's fair, out of here. He flexes his power with that swing, and they cut into the lead. It's 5-4. 
Now it's the second baseman, Justin Foscu. Out to short, Jones collects it. On to first, and yeah, they get the out. Josh Young getting ready to now hit, one for two. Next offering misses, and it's two and one. Next offering is fouled back. The pitch. That one to first. Lays out, but he can't squeeze it. That's the inning. Top six, and now the catcher comes up to here. Blake Hunt. Two, two. Tap back to the mound, and it gets by him. Now the left fielder, Nico Holsizer. The next pitch misses, and yeah, that's ball two. Back to the mound. Feeds to second, out there. Now to first, and it's a double play. Xavier Edwards will hit next. The 1-1. One, one. And there's yeah, a ball. One strike. That's Next one three. misses. Three and one now. Three balls, one strike. And a pitch. Fouls one away, and now three and two. And he deals. Swing and a foul ball at the plate. They'll do it again. And a three two. On the ground right side, and it goes just foul. Fouled off again, and it remains three and two. The pitch. In the air, fairly deep to right field. And that is that. Back now for the bottom of the sixth, and there's a new pitcher on the mound. Phoenix Sanders trying to protect this lead. of the sixth inning and now it's going to be Carl Chester the wind and the pitch lifted in the air right center field Schnell settles under this one makes the catch and there's one gone here's the left fielder Steel Walker no left fielder Steel Walker 3-2 now Hard hit to third. Zips it across, and that quickly two away. Here's a speed threat. Bubba Thompson, who's over two with a pair of strikeouts. Here comes a 3-2. Lined, and that's a base hit. Nice job of driving that pitch the other way on a line. You know, hitters... They take so many reps in the cages, working on going to the opposite field, and it doesn't always translate into the game, but right there it did, and he did it perfectly. And now they've got some speed on first, so we'll see if they try to get him into motion. At the belt and fires. Just a weak fly ball this time. 
Grabs it on the run. And that will end the inning. Top of inning number seven. Here's the shortstop at the play. Greg Jones. And the right hater deals. So a foul ball makes it one and two. Swing and a ball lifted in the air. Shallow left field. And a base hit. And the leadoff man aboard. So digging in, Cameron Meisner for the fourth time tonight. And here's a 3-2. In the air, left side. And puts the squeeze on that. And there's one down. Curtis Mead, the next to hit. One for three. Jones stands at first with one out. Vanasco checks the runner. Back in safe, really close. First offering, runner goes. Pitch outside. Throw to second, and he's safe. One run game, one out, one on. That one out to right. No trouble here. Puts it away for the out. Two down. And now the first baseman, number four. Now batting, number four. Three and two now. Stays alive. Two outs. Swing and a miss. And that is that. Welcome back. And stepping in is the speedy Dustin Harris. Kicks and deals. You know, this guy's great speed is in the back of that pitcher's mind. If he can get on, it's going to give him one more thing he's got to think about. Swing and a miss as he was out front that time. Line drive, base hit. Around first and hustling for second. Here's the throw. Not going to get him. He's in there. Well, that may end up being an at-bat we go back to later on when this game is over. He got a pitch he could drive, but he didn't get too excited like a lot of guys do and pull off the baseball. Really good timing all the way through the swing, and the barrel was so on plane with the ball. Easy drive into the gap for that double. Me pulls it down, and there's one away. Man, he just couldn't lay off right there. Those high fastballs, they just look really good because they're eye level, but they're just about impossible to get the barrel to. You know, Boog, if you're that base runner at second base, you want to be quiet out there. Not bouncing around, not distracting your teammate, the hitter. Make sure that he can clearly focus on that pitcher and that release point. Right field, down the line, and that one slices down. And a pitch. And a foul ball. And a foul ball, he stays alive. Man at second. And that one fouled off. Got him looking. That's out number two. Number 17 will take over here. He'll try to strand the runner at second. Now the number two hitter, Justin Foscu. Man on second, two down. And that one upstairs. The two one. Runner at second, two down. 
Now just to cement mixer slider right there. It's a great pitch to hit if you can recognize it early and jump on it. Turned on, but that's foul down the third baseline. So good solid contact right there. Just a bit out in front of that fastball. Got to try to stay on that backside just a little bit longer and see if you can do some damage. Next pitch misses, and it's three and two. So the tying run at second. Hard hit, but right at him and left. And welcome back. And now the DH, number 64. Swing and a pop-up. Foul territory for the catcher. Garcia makes the catch, and there's one away. Now here is Nick Schnell. Nick Schnell. Righty delivers. That one drifts inside. Two and one now. Right side, hard hit. And he can't come up with it. But plenty of time to recover. And that's the second out. Two outs, base is empty. Now it's going to be Blake Hunt. Check swing, but he went too far. And the count, one and two. High fly ball out of the left center field. And that is that. Ready for the bottom of the eighth. Now the third baseman, Josh Young. You get to this part of the order. Yeah, there's some pop there, but more likely there are some base hits. So very important to be patient. Let the pitcher walk you, if he will. Now this is in the air down the line. Meisner pulls that one down, and there's one down. At the play, Carl Chester. Looking to get the tying run on base. Swing and a miss. One and two. The tying run at the plate. Stays alive. The pitch. Line drive, base hit. And that puts the tying run on base. Oh, this has been a really nice game at the plate for him. He looks locked in. Absolutely hammered that baseball very loud coming off the bat. 107 was the exit velocity, and at that speed, it's going to be a great result more often than not. Jack Lebowski on to pitch here, and he'll do his best to hang on to this lead. So up next, Steel Walker. The pitch. This one in the air right field. Meisner coming on. He's got it. And there's two down. Maybe caught that one off the end just a little bit. Couldn't quite barrel it up enough to really drive it. So two down now. And here is Bubba Thompson. Line drive. Fair ball. Runner around third on his way to the plate. The relay, and he's out. Cut down, and that ends the inning. Now on the bump, Stephen Velines. It's his job to keep his team in the game. set for the start of the inning. Now the left fielder, Nico Holsizer. And the pitch. That's out to center field. Thompson gets under it. Makes the catch. One away. 
So digging in, Xavier Edwards. Here's a 2-1. Swing and a foul back. That's out of play. The 2-2. Two -two. Upstairs. One run game here in the top of the ninth. hammered center field that's back turning looking and that one is gone he blasts one out to center and they tack one on the board it's 6-4 knew what pitch he wanted to hit spit on some other pitches in this at bat was very patient and it paid off next to hit Greg Jones here comes a pitch Swing and a miss, and he got him. Two gone now. Cameron Meisner now at the plate. The 3 1. The right hander gives up the two out walk. You get a walk, and you get a walk. Everyone gets a walk, Boog. Here's the third baseman, Curtis Meade. Is a 1-1. One, one. Nope. Just it's off the right inside right. edge. The 3-1. In the air, out towards right center. Chester racing over to make the catch. now as they hand the ball to a fresh arm to start the bottom of the ninth number 32 and he'll work on holding this lead back here at the ballpark and here is Davis Wenzel Hey, look, we'll see how it factors in. I just can't emphasize how much that insurance run in the top of the ninth means. I mean, just such a big difference mentally when you're chasing two runs instead of one. One up, one down. And here's the first baseman, first Dustin base. Harris. He's someone that you might not describe as having elite level speed, but he can absolutely move, and it is a factor in his game. Left hand batter waits. They say you win. Look, this guy's definitely a plus runner, but what I love about him is that he goes all out every single time, never takes a break. It's guys like that, even though they don't have the elite speed, the fact that they're consistent with it, they make moves on the base paths. In the air, out towards left center. That's out number two. Now the catcher up to hit, David now Garcia. Now you got the number nine hole hitter right here. Looking to do whatever he can to get on base, turn this lineup over so the best hitters in this lineup have a chance to tie up the ball game or maybe even walk it off. This one popped up. Foul ground, first base side. And that is the ball game. Well, this was a tightly played game. Got a little of everything. Some timely hitting, runs on the board. Key pitching and defense in certain spots. Definitely a fun one to watch. And this one ends with a final score of 6-4 to four. for Chris Singleton and our entire crew here at MLB The Show. Thanks for stopping by. I'm John Chomby. Talk to you soon.
for the victorious Montgomery Biscuit. Six runs, ten hits, no errors. They left seven men on base. For the Rough Riders, four runs on nine hits, no errors. They left five men on base. Time of the ball game, three hours and 21 minutes. Thank you for joining us here this evening. We remind you to please drive home safely.